Hey guys, what's going on and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth! Where are we? We just unlocked the negative. That just happened. Like... 20 minutes ago, because I'm going two in a row here. Uh, and we're gonna play as Eve. I wanna play as Eve. I was talking about it last episode. It's fresh in my mind. I kinda like doing more than one recording a day. Because I could remember a little bit more about the last run. Also, I went back to the last run. We picked up Pageant Boy. I didn't know that. I, it completely flew out of my mind. So, we are starting as Eve, and Eve's damage is pretty poopy. Uh, and I actually remembered this time. Uh, M B Q P D B K R. That is our seed. So, her stats are pretty poor, but she starts with something called the Dead Bird, which is whenever we take damage, we'll summon a little bird man, and he will pop out and do some damage for us. But we also start with uh, Horror Babylon. Now, usually Horror Babylon, uh, first off, gives you a damage and a speed upgrade. Uh, for as long as it's active, it is a passive. But we don't get that unless we are at a red heart. Only one red heart. So I'm going to get hit one more time, just to show you. And it says, what a horrible night to have a curse. And now, our damage is much better. Our speed's nice. And... Uh, we could, you know, stay at this heart. So I'm gonna try to stay at one red heart. I don't want to pick up that heart upgrade. I'd rather have this damage upgrade and this tears upgrade. Feels like a tears upgrade. Um, oh wait, no, that was because of Liberty Cap that we just picked up. But, the thing with this character is that you really want to strive to have a spirit heart, or nothing but spirit hearts, instead of red hearts, so you can stay in this state. So, Eve is pretty sweet. I really like playing as her. Uh, you know, she's a high-risk, high-reward character. I like that. I also like Judas. Kind of has the same thing going for him. Uh, so, I haven't even talked about our space bar item. We got Unicorn Stump. Now, if we get a, if we get an orbital, uh, then this becomes infinitely better. But what it does is, for a certain amount of time, you can see, uh, we're invulnerable. And we could use it once a room. Uh, now, we can't actually deal any damage, though, unless we have an orbital with it. So, obviously, that makes it much better if we do acquire one. We won't get one here, but hopefully in the future we get, like, a cube of meat or something like that. So, we got another damage upgrade, which is phenomenal. I'm not going to pick up these red hearts. I'm really looking for a spirit heart. And it doesn't seem like we're going to get one. Uh, so we're just going to drop down, and that'll be our first floor, and I'm okay with that. Uh, but yeah, what else is there to say, man? I'm ready. Bring it on with your penis-shaped map. Okay, it's no longer penis-shaped. Uh, but yeah, I really don't want to take any damage whatsoever because I would want to deal with the devil. And if we could trade, like, just one red heart away, get some spirit hearts, uh, and hold this horror Babylon, then that would be phenomenal. That's a bunch of money. I don't have any bombs. And there's our boss. And you know what? I think I'm going to go fight him right away. Uh, one, because we have our Horror Babylon, and there's a Red Heart blocking our path back. And it's a monster, which I'm very happy about. So I want, more than anything, I think if I had to pick an item, uh, I would like Squeezy. It's a tears upgrade. You know, it improves our DPS. And, uh,. What is it? And it gives us spirit hearts. So we can kind of stay in this horror Babylon state. We should be getting a deal with the devil, so that shouldn't be concerned at all. And that's a damage upgrade, which I will happily take. And, well, there it is. Uh, I'm doing it. We're going the distance. Dark Matter, I believe it's a small damage upgrade. I could be wrong, but it also gives you fear shots. And then Blood Clot gives you a damage upgrade in one eye. So every other shot will be doing additional damage. Um... So we are, we are fairly strong. Oh my god, <laughs> we we are we are kind of strong, and we almost died right there. That guy almost got us. Now there's a tinted rock. If I get a bomb, that could be huge. You know, get some spirit hearts, not die in one shot. That'd be pretty big. Um, but I really love this high risk, high reward kind of gameplay. Uh, it's what I enjoy the most. You know, going for some crazy nonsense and. You know, it pays off and you feel really good, or you get your ass kicked and then you die and... then that's it, you're dead. So... These guys just spawn a bunch of flies, they don't concern me too much. 
Just kidding. That guy totally sniped me in the face. But we have red hearts all over the place, so I'm not really sweating it too much. And that's another key. If I had two more cents, I would go check out the shop. And that's the bean. Just, just, yeah, it's just, I didn't even have to say it. It answered for me. I'm going to keep this unicorn stump. Uh, on the assumption that we might need it, and it might save our life at one point, so... We're gonna hold on to it. Oh my god, that is the best thing I've ever seen. Okay, so we're gonna get these tinted rocks. Any health is... It's orgasmic, man. What do you, what do you want? Ah, uh, ooh. Okay, so I can't get to that yet. But what I'm gonna do is drop this bomb right in the center pick up all this money, and then we're gonna go check out our shop, and really hope that there's a bomb in it, so we can get that other tinted rock. Hot damn, and a key, which I will take. The boomerang, I believe I've went over it before. It's not very good. Yeah, it, it will, okay, no, it's it's fine. It, it could be very resourceful if you don't have flying, it could pay out uh, and be, you know, huge for you, but Eh, that's good. I'm going for it. <laughs> uh, okay. I sh No, I love Bob's brain. Y'all can shut your mouths. If it kills me, then, then, then you can complain. But if it doesn't kill me and it carries really hard, well, then it looks like I'm a smart man and you're a big silly dude. Uh, or a lady, but either way. So, Bob's brain, if you... Uh, I think I've gotten it before. I could be wrong. Uh, but if I haven't, what it does is, when it appears, oh boy, yeah. when you shoot, you have a, you throw the brain out, and the brain will come into contact with something, it explodes. Um, it's on a timer, like, it'll come back after a certain amount of time. So, what makes it so good is, you know, it's AoE potential, you know, it can, it can hit a lot of things at once. Oh my god. Um, Wow. That's awesome. I wish I got the third one, and we could have just become Guppy instantly, but holy shit, we are two-thirds Guppy in one room. I'm picking them both up. Dead Cat doesn't affect our health at all, because we're at one Red Heart already, which is awesome. Um, but yeah, Bob's Brain, you know, could obviously beat your ass if you don't use it correctly. You know, you could hurt yourself with it. Wow. Um, okay, so... I'm not going to pick either of those up just yet. Bear with me. I don't have a lot of keys, so I don't want the effect of the tail um, spawning a bunch of chests if I don't have a bunch of keys. And I don't want Dead Cat, because if we get another deal with the devil, I think it's still possible. Uh, if we do get another deal with the devil, then we could spend this red heart um, and then come back and then basically get like a health upgrade. So, that's my reasoning. I'm sticking to it. We're an item away from Guppy. Um, and that's pretty awesome. Right, this guy's being a giant pain in the ween. So, let's kill that first. You're getting a Bob's brain. Right to your face. Two of spades. That doubles our keys. So, I'm gonna pop it right meow before we go in here. And you know what? Infestation's not bad. Whenever we take damage, we'll spawn some attack flies. The attack flies scale with our damage. You know, I always, I always go over it. It's a good item. You know, hopefully we, we don't take a lot of damage, but if we do, we'll be, uh, we'll be generating some flies to help us. Okay. So I'm going to maximize Bob's brain's effectiveness because it is a baller item. And what we're going to do is wait for it to spawn. And then we're going to wait for these little conga line men. Totally jack that name straight from Northern Lion, but don't hate. And I was trying to blow up this tinted rock. And... I thought the Bob's Rain explosion was going to be a little bit bigger. But it wasn't. And there's a bomb anyway. So, let's blow this ish up. Get ourselves another Spirit Heart. More protection is good to me. And we got Pestilence. And I think I talked about Pestilence before. I talk about Pestilence every single time we fight him. The dude is strong. He's a strong boy. He doesn't mess around anymore. Like, look at these. Look at these bombs. He's out to get me. But we're having a pretty good fight. 
The fear shots kind of cornered him. And we did not get a deal with the devil, but that's okay. Because we are two-thirds guppy, baby. And another tinted rock. What about this bomb over here? Oh, that is on Bomb Island, so that's not going to happen. Uh, Yeah, we'll go in here, too. Hey, okay. Yeah, well, that's just rude. All right, so contract from below. Whenever we get a drop, we'll get two drops instead. We are still on normal mode, so we should be seeing a lot of drops. Give me that, give me that. We are two-thirds to the gup. Now, I could really, 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 you know, go out of my way and maybe get a three-cent bomb out of here. Is it worth a key to really gamble with that, though? I mean, our health's pretty low. Like, I would have looked like a genius, right? There's not even a bomb in here. So, I mean, we could have looked like a genius. That's the key word. So we'll just go. Yeah, we'll be fine. Uh, I mean, we're going to have to be fine because, you know, we're either going to be fine or we're going to be dead as shit. Um, but if I do think that Bob's brain is going to hurt us, I can pop the unicorn stump immediately. Also, this is wealth, but at what cost paying out instantly with the double chests, which is sweet. Thank you, Bob's brain. And we do have an orbital now. What the hell am I doing, baby? Get, get over here. So now, since we have this orbital, except in this room, of course, because, you know, I wanted to talk about it. Thank you, Bob's Ring. Um, we could just pop, oh my. Yeah, I'm gonna go for it. Balls of steel and tears down. You know what, that's fine. If you, do, are you sure? Are you sure? All right, if you want it. So we got this unicorn stump combined with our orbital and a lot of rooms just got a lot easier assuming that we could actually walk into them like so if we could walk into them then they're in trouble there you go so that tears down is a bummer so is the payout from those uh but very worth uh, oh god. I I lost my train of thought. What was I saying? <laughs> I was talking about Bob's Reign, and then I was talking about the combination of this. I, I wasn't happy with the double golden chest thing. It kind of sucked. Alright, Hollow, you are so boned. We're just going to give you a big old smooch on the face. I'm not going to take that health upgrade yet. Ooh, but what if the, I get more than one deal with the devil? Okay, I'm going to take it. Okay, it, I'm, I, I am going to take Brother Bobby, so we go back into our Horror Babylon state. But if there was more than one deal with the devil, and one costed like one, and then the other costed two, then if I walked in there with two, we could have had both of them. But if I only walked in with one, then I could have uh, missed out on an item that w would have been otherwise free. So I don't mind too much doing what I did. Alright, so... Can't deal with these until our stump is done doing its, its stump thing. There you go. Oh man, these keys. I would love that champion's belt. That's a damage upgrade and it spawns more champions for us, which on normal mode is a good thing because they always drop stuff. And that's a rosary. That, that makes it so the Bible is more likely to show up. I'm going to take it, you know? Maybe. I don't know if this... I don't know if it's enough faith up to make us get a deal with the angel instead of a deal with the devil. I doubt it. Yeah, that's free. Can't argue that, right? Alright, so you know what? This part of the fight is a, annoying. So I'm going to stand here and melt his ass with my cube. And then the second half of it... This guy's a lot less tanky. Um... But maybe getting the Bible in a shop wouldn't be a bad thing. I mean, we, we can kill Mom instantly with it. We can kill Mom's heart instantly with it. Maybe. I mean, we're 13 minutes in on what? Catacombs 2? Maybe we'll do the boss rush. Finally, right? 
never thought this day would actually show up. I mean, if we become Guppy, then, uh... I'd imagine we'll definitely be going there, but... Judas's tongue. No, you know what? I'm gonna stick with this. And I, I, I have to remember that this is every single room. So there's no reason not to do it. Oh, until, uh, until right now. God damn it. Alright, what do we got? Money and a bunch of bombs. I could look for the secret room. Let's get a lay of the land. So it could be here. It's possible. Hey. More bombs. Alright. You know what? I'm gonna go for it. I would love to see some more of our pills. Maybe a magic mushroom, wink wink. Bad gas. Pretty fly. 48 hour energy. And a tears down. Well, you know what? I guess I'll hold on to the tears down. Just in case we run into a PhD somehow. But I highly doubt it since we picked up that rosary. Uh, let's go. Let's maybe, maybe put the pedal to the metal a little bit. Maybe do the boss rush room. Get it done with Eve, right? Um, I could blow up these mushrooms too. Save our bombs. Funny enough, I could have went back in here. Anyway. But we're not going to talk about that, because it doesn't matter. And this is an XL floor. So, if we find the bosses... No, I take that back. If we find just the bosses... Also, I think I'm going to take Mom's Pearl. Increases our chances of getting Spirit Hearts. Oh my. This is beautiful. Bad gas. Well, better than Tears Down. Alright. Uh, but, I would like to find our... Our shops first. Our shop and our two item rooms would be nice for the bosses. We still have five whole minutes. That's a decent amount of time. I think we can, in five minutes, complete everything and get a boss rush going. And that's a tears down pill, so I guess I'll hold on to this for now. Get him, Bob. Get him! What a bro. What an MVP. Got some money. I'm, I don't know, man. I would like to find the shop, though. It's going to be a big floor. I kind of panicked. Not going to lie. I can't really do anything during this. But I thought I was going to get hit. Um, Just because our speed's really good. And I kind of sort of ran like straight into him. But... Oh, boy. We still have a decent amount of time. Four minutes. It's not as decent as you might think, but it's not bad. I guess we could check for the secret room at the same time as getting this guy. And instead of the shop, because I'm almost certain the shop is going to have the Bible in it. But what if I want the Bible? Instead of, I mean, I like the unicorn combo, but what if we just one-shot mom? That might be crucial to getting our boss rush. What if we don't get boss rush without that? Oh, boy. Hmm, the clock's ticking, Anthony. You got a lot of things to make up your mind on. Oh my. it's a lot of bombs. Followed by... A luck down. Well, could have been worse. Um... I don't know, there's a lot of things we could do here. Oh! There's the Bible. <laughs> it had to show up at some point. Um, picking up the, ros the rosary greatly increases your chances of the Bible showing up. So I suppose it was only a matter of time. It just depend on where we were going to get it. Um, but that's that's great. Uh, I'm totally down with it. So what does the Bible actually do? Uh, it gives you flying for a room. Yeah, that doesn't sound very good, right? But it also, when used against the mom fight and the heart fight. Also, thank you. Two hearts isn't very useful, but I'll keep it. Um... It one-shots them. It kills them instantly. Here's our shop. Blue map. You know what? I'm gonna buy it. We have a couple bombs. It's gonna make sure that we find every single secret and, uh, super secret? Oh my. And now, I see where our boss probably is. Which is way over there. So maybe we should start putting the pedal to the metal a little bit. I would like to get to Boss Rush. It would be a change of pace. There's still two item rooms to find. Now one. So that's good. Um, 
But like I said, the Bible might be the make or break. Because, you know, the first fight will kill it real fast. Yum Heart is not very good. Well, I mean, not as good as what we got. And, uh... Two minutes. Oh, my. And a Diamonds card. We could go back to that beggar, but I don't know if I have time. Homing Bombs is pretty sweet. We're gonna start booking it a little bit. Uh, uh, okay, no Guppy. That's okay. Keep my two of hearts card. It might come in handy somewhere down the line. And I'm gonna take Liberty Cap. The damage might become very important. You never know. Uh, but yeah, we gotta start... We gotta start going. I gotta move. I'm on the clock. What? I thought that was for sure. Ah, oh, it's because we got a big room. I'm gonna skip stuff. This room's getting skipped. Sorry, card. All right, this room is not getting skipped. <laughs> there you go. Go. Big room. Skip it. Uh. Run. What? Did you push it out of the way, you fat asshole? Oh, it's a homing bomb. God damn it. Alright. Alright, nothing's around anymore. Let's get our spirit hearts. Uh oh. Uh oh. 30 seconds. Go! Get out of my way! Ow, really? Now you're just being rude. Where is this boss? Get out of my way. We're gonna make it. Oh my god, this floor is huge! There's the boss. Kill him. Kill it. Go. Die. Oh, it's the cage. I can do this. Just get all up inside of him. Wait. Come on. Come on. And then, and then, and then go. Can't look at the. Oh, the downtime. Die. No. Are you, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh, oh my god. The cage wouldn't die. He had to be super selfish with his death animation. I missed it by like two seconds. Fuck. When did we get flying? Oh, that's that's from the Bible. I don't even know what I skipped in there. I can't, I can't leave. All right. That was... That was mind-blowing. I don't even know what to say to that. Oh, man, for shame. We didn't even get to deal with the devil, by the way. Hopefully we get to deal with the devil here so we can become Guppy and maybe win. That blows, man. I went into, like, a bigger circle than I had to go in. And just everything just fell apart. The cage fight took forever. Of course we got the cage, by the way. I don't know if that's the first time you guys got to see him on the the let's play but he is a tanky dude and I sacrificed a lot of hearts just running into him and trying to do what I could what thought there wasn't rocks in there for some reason I have no idea whatever um but yeah total boner killer I was probably like a second off <laughs> that's so that's something else, man. Um, so thankfully we have this Horror Babylon effect. If we didn't, we'd be super, super weak. And uh, I don't even know what I skipped. Hopefully, against the cage, I skipped like a health upgrade that I wouldn't have taken. Because I want to keep Horror Babylon. That's that's the dream. Uh, if I had to skip something, that's what it was. And we're just we're just looking for the boss, man. I really want a deal with the devil. I really want to become Guppy. That would be really big for us. Considering how bad the end of that floor was for doing what we did. So Damn. Also, Bob's brain. I talked about it. But I didn't, you know, I said it! I haven't really thrown it in a lot of your guys' faces that don't like it. It's putting in work. It's doing a lot of damage to a lot of things that aren't me. 
Because I'm not a silly goose and I know how to use it. Okay. You know what? How about that? How about that, boy? It's even helping us with our speedrun strats of uh, totally going the wrong way and having to go back anyway, miss. God damn it. All right. Come on, Fishula. We're doing it. Oh, you know what? Good. I'm glad you hit me. Because now I have Dead Bird. And he's gonna eat all of you. So, suck on that. Can't believe I didn't get the boss rush. <laughs> it's, it's lingering. It's stuck in my head. It's crawling through my skin. These, these wounds that cannot heal. At least not, not now. Not after giving all that health to the cage for nothing. Alright, this is showtime. It's, uh... Give me a deal with the devil time. I need it to be, like, maybe, like, a guppy's paw. I'm, I want to get, like, a health upgrade in here. This guy's going to give me a health up. Never mind. He's going to give me a cube of meat. But we're still going to get a deal with the devil. It's going to make us guppy. And that alone is going to carry us because we're going to be super strong. There you go. That's exactly what's going to happen. Hmm. Now, this horse flying around the room can do us a solid... And oh, I killed him. <laughs> I was gonna say he can he can kill these for us. Oh man, but two, Bob's brain is just too MVP for that. All right, go. And it's a Krampus. Um, I would really like a lump of coal. I don't want Krampus's head. We could use the Bible to one shot. Uh, Mom's heart. And that's it's pretty good. And will save us probably a lot of health considering how. Underwhelming, we've. I feel now. I don't feel very strong anymore. Head of Krampus has just been unlocked, but we did get the lump of coal, and we are Guppy, baby. Yeah. Is that the first time we did it? Is that the first time we did it? Yes. We are the Gups, and I'm taking my Bible, and I'm taking that Emperor card, and we're just gonna go. Hell yes. So I could go fight Mom's Heart right now with this Emperor card. Uh, but that ain't happening. We're going to save the Emperor card for the Dark Room. Um, that is much more important to have. Because we are not strong for the Dark Room. So I'd rather get straight to the boss. What's this? It's a two hearts. Or wait, what the hell am I talking about? We still have to fight Sheol too. Ooh, you could be good too. All right, well, we're going to save this Emperor card until the last, last part, if possible. That is what I would like to do. But we're Guppy, baby. So what does becoming Guppy do? Grants us flying, which is beautiful. But on top of the flying, it also grants us these, uh, these flies whenever we deal damage. Really? I can't take that. I really need the Horror of Babylon. Um, so, we're going to be generating a poop load of flies. The flies are going to be doing almost all of our damage. It's going to be sweet. I'm I'm hyped. Uh, do I want their spread patch? Not really. I'm excited. You should be excited. Come back. First time into the dark room. And we're not totally screwed. Um, yet. We're not screwed yet. We might still be screwed. Because of all the stuff that we missed. And the boss rush room that we did not get to. What the... No. But these flies are probably going to carry us. They already, they already are carrying us. Petrified poop ain't happening. And I'm pretty hyped for this super secret room. Because we have a lover's card back there. And if the super secret room is, uh, you know, the dark looking one, then we can. My. Oh, yeah. Give me that. Hey, we unlocked the parasite. I don't know why, but I'm down. Uh, okay, so our damage is getting better and better. 
and these fly scale with our damage. So we're we're becoming much stronger. This is getting this is getting real cute. Oh, we don't need that because we're flying. So let's get this. Hopefully. Yeah, excuse me. Did I did I miss? Thank you. Okay, so that's that's poop. So never mind. We're not even gonna go back for that lover's card. We're gonna keep the emperor. Uh, generate a bunch of flies. So we, uh, we're not even gonna use them. I just realized because this boss is gonna get dunked by our Bible. And here we go. Bloop. That feels nice, doesn't it? Uh, excuse me? Are you, uh... Are you shitting on my balls right now? Did we, we... We didn't get Sheol? That just happened? Is that is that the end? No. No, we just became Guppy. Don't do this to me, game. No. Nope. I don't want to hear it. If I walk into that chest, uh, the game's over. So, this game can go fuck itself. I'm gonna go find myself a Joker card, and we're gonna go, we're gonna force it. I am not done with this run, sir. Thanks for the offer. Thanks, but no thanks. Ow, Bob's Green. Why you do this? I talk so highly of you. Yeah, this shit ain't happening. We gotta find a Joker card. And, oh, right here. Now, this is it. Red chest in here. And then it's gonna take us straight to the deal with the devil. Let's just blow up these fires right quick so we can take our hearts. Never mind. God damn it. Uh. Uh oh. We're running out of floor. Oh, troll bomb. And we got pride. Pride can drop a card. It's not a card that helped us, but he did drop a card. All right, so I am gonna pick this up, so I can gamble on this guy a little bit. All right. This runs over, isn't it? Totally is. Pay out. Do it. Oh, you're a little wiener, aren't you? Is there a red chest in here? No. Okay. Come on, little homie. I know the chances of it happening are astronomically low. No! You little shit! Not done. Oh! I gotta play this guy now so we can get in there. I refuse. Alright, we're done. <laughs> That's all she wrote. God damn! I, I really worked for it. And I wanted the, I can't believe the boss rush. But not only that, we became Guppy. You can see how incredibly strong it is. I had the Emperor card. Uh, and that's, that's it. We're done. You're gonna pay out. I'm gonna make you pay out. Demo. This is the last chance or you're, you're getting a bomb in your head. Now that you know, I mean, if somebody threatens you with an explosive, see what I mean? Sometimes, you just gotta threaten people with explosives. Don't actually do that, please. Um, but, if you do, you didn't get the idea from me. That's all. Yeah, that's it! I can't, like, do something crazy. I can't, like, Emperor card. Or... We're done. Well, that's that. Experimental treatment. And a little baggy. And that's it. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. It is greatly appreciated. Uh, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe. All of these things are awesome, and you are awesome for being here and listening to this commentary and watching. And I'm sure you've already typed your comment, laughing your fucking ass off about what happened. In the cage fight, in the mob fight, I don't want to hear it. You have a great night, or a great afternoon, or a great morning, or a great fap, you know, whatever, whatever the next step in your day is. 
But no matter what, I will see you next time.